probably access to capital, um, regulatory challenges. There are a number of regulatory that challenges that exist in many markets. Uh, also access to different types of capital. There's venture capital, there's project finance. I think there's quite a bit of venture capital starting to move into the area. The larger dollars for smaller technology projects. We see that as, as being a real capital gap. Um, also government commitments to this market area. When policy changes, money stops flowing. So you really need consistent government policy for money to keep moving and flowing rapidly. Uh, and governments have a tendency to change. They change their policies and their approach to the marketplace, and money flows on that basis. Oh, I think the growth opportunities are everywhere. Like the, the, when we started investing in this marketplace probably 15, 20 years ago, the idea of green technologies, clean sustainability was very, it was, uh, very fringe. Now it's very common. You can talk to the top uh, power companies, and the concept of renewable power is they know about it, they understand it, and how it fits into their system. Um, same with politicians. It's now a powerful thing that, that mobilizes people, and people are demanding more energy efficient power, services, everything. So it really per it's pervaded the entire marketplace. Well, we've, uh, we live in Canada, where Canada is blessed and it's cursed. We have the biggest country in the world, and we have a very small population. So our government has had to invest substantial dollars into thinking through our use of resources. Um, and unfortunately, in investing in many of the technologies, there's not a big market for us to take the technologies to. So what we're doing in our company and working with various people's, uh, people back in Canada, we're looking to bring technologies, what we call high growth technologies, into high growth markets. And uh, Singapore is an excellent window into Asia. And that's what we're looking at very much on a beachhead strategy basis. Very much so. Yeah, we came down, we came down a number of years ago and the relationships have just gotten stronger and stronger and stronger as, as time has, has gone by. And candidly, the forum, the, 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 the forum that, that you provide access to here, the conference forum, has worked very well for us. We have a number of people that we see, or like I've got a number of colleagues that I've invested with out of Europe that come to this event. So the ability to network with people that I know physically here is, is, is increasing on an annual basis. So uh, we've worked um, for probably the last 14 months on a, on a contract with EDB, and that's it's, a, it's what we call an accelerator relationship. And we will bring those companies down to Singapore, help them establish a, a, form, a, a formal footprint here for access into Asia. Uh, Singapore also, they've got a number of very good projects or um, programs focused on helping small companies. For example, there's a program called Spring, and Spring helps companies go from Singapore into Malaysia, into Indonesia. So we're looking to take advantage of those very dynamic relationships. Canada is, is uh, a long ways away, it's 12 hours away. Um, so you're physically here, you're able to get to those markets much, much more effectively, and EDB saw that and approached us and said, we'd like to form the following alliance with you. And uh, it's worked out very well. We're very pleased with how that's, uh, how that's come to pass. We're in the clean tech finance business. So if I'm looking at the perfect, the perfect nexus of activities, you've got clean tech colleagues, you've got finance colleagues, uh, you've got good discussions of projects, uh, you've got a wonderfully, a wonderfully uh, you know, dynamic city to come to. Uh, so I'd say it's a combination of all of those things. We will definitely be here next year. Uh, and I think we'll uh, we'll also be a, possibly a little more active as a sponsor and, and and try to host more more gatherings as part of the mix too. I think by actually bringing a group of those different conferences together, it will make it an even more dynamic um, offering for us in particular. Definitely.